Fencing going up around Edmonton's infamous Talus Dome Monday afternoon to protect it from unwanted intruders. I pull up, couldn't believe it. Some dude is stuck inside the Talus balls. Look at this. A 26 year old man is facing a criminal code charge after getting trapped in the art installation and needing multiple fire crews to rescue him. Uh, definitely a first for me, yeah. It all happened around sunset. One witness telling City News she was in the middle of a picture when she noticed a man on top of the pile of silver balls slip in. But getting out more complicated. Yeah, there was a lot of uh, steel on the inside of that structure to try to get through, so we had to use the uh, our heavy rescue tools to get through that. Firefighters taking an hour and a half and needing to remove one of the thousand balls with the jaws of life. Definitely different, not what we would typically use it for. We do a lot of weird things, but uh, they work just fine there in uh, helping us get them up. The man assessed by paramedics before being handed over to police. Edmonton police say the 26 year old man who they are not naming is facing one charge of mischief over 5,000, noting he damaged several of the balls while climbing on the structure. This is not the first time Edmonton's polarizing $600,000 art installation has been damaged in its 11 year life at the side of the white mud. In 2015, it cost over $5,000 to repair a number of dents. And vandals have hit the shiny structure with paint on a number of occasions. As for how much this latest one will cost, no one from the city or the Edmonton Arts Council were able to comment Monday because of the home. Holiday. Fire crews saying they will work with the city to secure the dome until it can be repaired. In Edmonton, Carly Robinson, City News.